Hi, I'm Chris Berman. Ahead on ESPN, the golden child, Tom Brady, 27 years old and two Super Bowl rings already. Not too shabby. We'll see him on the road to what he hopes will be ring number three in this one. Buccaneers, Eagles, now. The fans are finding their way to their seats, uh, those who really own those seats, as we get set to begin this exciting game. Hi folks, I'm Dan Steve, and welcome to Lincoln Financial Field. My friend and colleague Peter O'Keefe is beside me. Peter, this game features what could be an intriguing matchup between a talented tight end. It's heads. Number three, kicking off for the Buccaneers. There's the signal, and it's we're ready. For Eagle football. Number three boots the opening kickoff. Number 16 decides to take it out of the end zone. Tackle at the 20. A nice day for football. And ESPN Susie Culber will tell us if it will stay that way. Susie. Thank you, Dan. It's a beautiful temperate day. The conditions couldn't be better right now for a game of football. Back to you, Dan. Susie, thank you. The Eagles offense will start this drive at their own 20 yard line. Sanders picked up about seven, and that will bring up second down. Second and two. Ball at the Eagles, 27 yard line. Sanders gets the call again and runs into traffic. Sanders, the Stop ball at the 28. Number 54 with the tackle. Let's go, Eagles! Come on, get the first! Let's Third down, this. tight end to the left. Ball at the Eagles, 28 yard line. Scott loses one on the play and that will bring up fourth down. Barrett was a one-man wrecking crew back there. He powered into the backfield and made the tackle. They come up with the big play, and on third and short, they force the fourth down. Yeah, they even caused a loss of yardage. What a time to come up big. Number eight gets the ball and punts it away. Miller fields the punt at the 29. Brought down at the 37. Miller did a nice job getting some yards after fielding the solid punt. The Buccaneers ten, ten offense takes the field and they will start at their 37 yard line. Number seven takes it off the toss and ends up losing about three. Number two targeted the ball carrier early and didn't even let him get back to the line of scrimmage. They put a stop to this play behind the line of scrimmage. Pretty good call by the defense. Coordinator. Agreed, Dan. They, they had it all locked up. That will bring up second down. Brady throws it to the left sideline, and it's tipped incomplete. Nelson swatted that one away cleanly. The receiver didn't have a prayer in them. On second down, they try for the first, but it's played well by the defense. That will bring up third down. Nice pressure that time. And they get the first on third and long. Where's the heart, Eagles? Where's the defense? Tom Brady throws right past the coverage and into his receiver's hands. Nice throw. Third and long, and they get the big play to convert. What do you think of that, Peter? I love it. That's what football is all about, making the big plays when you need to, and you can't coach that. Ball at the 48 yards. Bernard gains eight yards, and that brings up second down. Bernard played smart and used his blockers to perfection on that last play. Peter, what a nice pickup to get them into a second and short situation. Yeah, great play, and now they have a bunch of options on what to try next. Vaughn gets the call on first second down, down and pays the price for the first down. I see counter. I first see and counter. ten. Ball at the 36. Number seven. Number 
seven. Had a defender close by, but was able to bring down the catch. Not much there. It'll be second down. Got to take what you can second get, Dan, but they were, you know, hoping for more. Harris hammers the receiver and forces him to drop the ball incomplete. Tom Brady might have been a little too cocky there, Dan. There were two guys on that receiver. And the pass ends up being incomplete, but you, you know, you're right. Either one might have picked it off. Well, it's all about reacting to what you see happening downfield, not what you wish you were seeing. That would have gotten the first, but it's incomplete, and it will be third down. Brady rifles this one hard over the middle, and it's off. Incomplete. Number 13. Ran a post pattern on that last play, but he couldn't make the catch. Third and long. They have a chance, but it's incomplete. Those are the situations where you want someone to step up and make the play. But no one did, and it will now be fourth down. Number 13 first catches down, it over the middle, and they somehow get the first off a big fourth and long. Number 13 makes the catch with three defenders on his case. I just don't know why uh, the throw was made into triple coverage. Hey, it worked. Yes, it did. They get the big fourth down conversion, on, and they do it in ten. dramatic fashion, All too. What a play. And they knew what they needed to do, stepped up and delivered. First down. Bernard had some blocking help on that last one, but he was still left with nowhere to go. Second and nine. Ball at the 17. Number 14 didn't haul that one in and it falls incomplete. Number 14 didn't have anybody on him and yet he couldn't make the catch. That may be a bigger incompletion than it looks. You're right, Dan. A shorter third down is an easier third down. Instead, they will stay put and have to take another shot. Barnett sacks him way back at the 24-yard line. Fourth down coming up. a turnover on down. Number two with the cover. Number two took care of his part of the field during this play. He plays the zone perfectly and disrupts the pass. Watch this. Yep, and the pass falls incomplete. That's great coverage. Peter, I